And hey, you know the routine if you've been around here before, but if you haven't, we're just going to run through it again. If you're watching live, type live in the comments. There we go. Thank there you, you go, Mr. Aaron. Sylvia. Thank you. All right. If you're watching a replay, type replay so that we know hey, that you caught the replay. And if you're listening to the podcast, mm -hmm. You know what to do. Just keep on listening. All right. And, and Kathy, hello. All right. Hi, guys. See, I'm seeing the house. Um, okay, this, the show must go on. The show must right? go on. We, we learned that. <laughs> DW, you know that, right? You're, you go back from, you know, playing, you know. Well, hey, you, you got to, no matter what happens with the sound and all that, you just got to keep on going. Matt Delman. All right. Matt, Matt, Matt Delman. Are you announced. packing our bags, Matt? Bags are packed. packed. Ready to go. Is that a song? Yeah. Okay. Leaving but on our Jeep. Jeep. <laughs> All right. Okay. We're going to see the Delnays tomorrow. Del They're down visiting the Florida. Hey, they great story. Hey, great. Um, I, I love this. Here, yes. uh, you know, hey, uh, uh, less than a year ago, they mm -hmm. weren't even a company. They're barely. They're barely a company. Yes. I know they'd be glad. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. But by, by <laughs> listening to the things in the Success Jordan's. Academy, all right. Mm -hmm. They now have what? How many trucks? Four hundred. All right. All right. There be a lot of trucks. Actually, I all think right. Are now it's finally taking. Seconds. There's money in the bank. Mm -hmm. Doing doing things. In fact, they going on vacation. Going on vacation. They come down here to Florida mm -hmm. with two hey, nannies. Mm -hmm. Well, because they have eighteen kids. Because eighteen, right? That's and right. All of twenty. Okay. So. <laughs> and so, hey, that's by you know, I, I don't want, it's just by doing the things that are in the Success Academy that we have in the Success Academy yes. for you. If you if you haven't if you're not part of the Success Academy yet, do it. Okay. Do it. Why not? Yeah. Yes, All right. Success Academy, everything you need to know to create, grow right. a plumbing business empire. That's right. Right. You know, and this, these are just the thing. Look, mm -hmm. it's just, it's not that, um, you know, these are earth shattering ideas. I've simplified it. Okay. Mm -hmm. it's, it's how I was able to, to go from one truck to, you know, to, to build the service company that we did and Sold live the that life sucker. that we did. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay. You know, but it's just like built, you know, when you plumb a house, there's a mm -hmm. certain way of doing it. Yes. All right. And if you do it this way, it works. <laughs> What okay. Do you know? <laughs> Doesn't always mean that the work is easy. Well, because it's not. Okay, but it works. It's simple. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, we we have another another one of our um, Success Academy uh, graduates. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Just flew two years ago. Mm -hmm. We're deeply in debt. Mm -hmm. All right. Hey, we're about ready to give up on everything. <laughs> There's a guy in a truck. Okay. Today they have like. 10 trucks, mm -hmm. you know, 18 months later, mm -hmm. they just flew on a private jet <laughs> out to Napa. To go visit some other MD peers. Right. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And they just bought another franchise, another mm -hmm. franchise, and oh. they're investing in property. Yes. Guys, it's just, it's just doing these right things. And all right. Just do what just, we say. Just do it. Okay. <laughs> Don't be like right. our teenagers. I, right. Just I've made do it. I made it easy you. for you. Okay. Just, it doesn't have to be complicated. You don't have to mm -hmm. do get on the, these other. There's other organizations that make it so complicated and all this other kind of stuff. It's and, dumb. Right. Okay. It doesn't have to be that way. But you got to You got to do it a certain way. Yes. Okay. And if you do it this way, and we it, know the way. Exactly. Exactly mm -hmm. how we lay out in the Success <laughs> Academy. So check it out. All right. Simply type success in the comments. Oh, yeah. That's or good go idea. to themilliondollarplumber.com forward four slash, slash success. success. Okay. It looks okay. like we're working. Everybody, can you hear Everybody? us? Okay. okay. So we did that. Um, there's one person on here that should be in bed. Okay, so that's all I'm saying. You know, it's just what I want. I don't mean. I mean it sounds like I'm, I'm I'm selling, <laughs> uh, but I am. I'm, this is just what I want for you. It's just I, I see it. That's what gives. I can't wait to see the Delmes tomorrow. I know. You know, it was First just time we get to meet them face right to face. face to face and mm -hmm. meet their you know lovely family. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna spend some time boating. I think we're gonna do that that kind of a thing. We're so looking um, forward to I'm that. But I'm so proud of them. Yes. Look, I, as a, for all of us that, that actually do these do these things. Mm -hmm. You know, you, they you know I it's like I'm the with a coach. Yes. You know, I, I'm. But you're in the ring, okay? Right. I'm, I'm, I'm the, the manager you're sitting Mickey. outside, right, outside you're the Mickey. ring saying, you know, watch out for the right, watch out for the left. You know, <laughs> hey, you know, he, dry, he drops his shoulder every time he gets ready to throw, you know, I'm yelling those kinds of things. You're the one in the ring right. getting it done. And that's what I love about the Delnays and mm -hmm. these others we mentioned, you know, that they, 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 they got hey, it done. Al. All right, hey, Big Al. Do they yeah. say, um... Do they say cut me Mick? Cut me Mick, right? Me. There, there are times, yeah. <laughs> I like that because that means they're, they're they're wanting to win. Right. You know, I'll do whatever it takes. Mm -hmm. You know, and th those are the ones that win. 
Okay, I'm not, I'm not talking whiners. Done. There's whiners and there's winners. That's right. Which okay? are you? Whiner but but you winner. can't be both. Mm-mm. All right? You cannot. That is a true statement. All right. You can't be both. That needs to be on a t-shirt. You're either a whiner or, or a, a winner. winner, but you can't be both. Mm-hmm. Okay? <laughs> All right. Do you want to get your computer the way it's supposed to be? Because I know I you know. like to see the comments and I stuff. I know. What's, what the heck is going on? freaked out right at the beginning. You know, guys ask me, oh. you know, do I have to be technology savvy? <laughs> no. <laughs> Hit the live uh, button there. So um, while you're doing good. that, hey, Mickey, while you're doing that, I okay. want to say... Um, Type text in the comments to get notified when we go live, um, because we will be making a change in platforms. Um, so you don't, you're not going to be able to say the comments that way. Anyway, yeah, well, I, well, I know. It's I, like uh, I did it your way, and there's no comments. It, hates you. it just hates it does. Go to the main page. Oh my goodness. Anyway, type text in the comments to get notified when we go live, <laughs> um, because we eventually will not be um, on Facebook Live. We'll be going on another platform. So for you guys so, that are worried about being tech, you know, mm-hmm. tech, tech, I can't even say the word <laughs> savvy. <laughs> Technolo- technically savvy. Savvy, right yeah you don't have to I, um, i'm not yeah that's it's not working for you honey just give up oh no there it is you got Son it of a you gun. did it what you did it oh Look there we you. go yeah. all right honey but way it's to like, go. hey i made it okay so there we are <laughs> this okay. thing is broken it's wrong. it doesn't I'm work i'm gonna throw this thing out the window <laughs> okay all right we're on okay. we're live now all we're talking right. about stuff yeah, we're talking yes, about and we're working. How, how to create on. more hours in a day. Okay. Hey, a question before we get started oh, sorry, on we this. Okay, we get we get on track here. Nope, questions for All right. There, you go, there we go. Mm-hmm. What household chore do you loathe doing? Loathe. Loathe. I, I chose that word. Loathe. loathe. I like it. Loathe. <laughs> I loathe. Okay, what household chore mm-hmm. do you loathe doing? Mm-hmm. Okay. I really hate. If you don't know what loathe means. Right. It's really um, hate. Send a link for the... Oh, see, everybody's wanting the coffee mugs. You guys want the coffee mugs? You want... Should we get... I know. We need coffee mugs and then also... We like got to get the store open. Like but I can't even figure out how to get my computer on, <laughs> let alone get a store where we can... You won't even do it anymore. I know. <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be like, make it so. They, they think I'm the million dollar plumber. <laughs> well, you are the million dollar plumber. That's why you don't do it. <laughs> right. Anyway, you that's guys right. want mugs? That's or... right. Do you, did you catch that? What? That's why I don't do it. <laughs> I am the... <laughs> <laughs> There's other reasons, but we'll use that one. As the Make it so, use. number one. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> okay. Laundry. Okay. Wait, go back to the mugs. If you guys okay. want mugs, let us know. We'll also, like some Yeti cooler type, th- or yeah. um, you know, like the drink things. We need to do it. Yeah. With, with Richard's face on it. MDP strong. MDP. Yeah. Need All right. That. Who doesn't? Need okay. That? Clean bathrooms. Get, hold on one second. We did just get for our Jeep. Everybody hasn't seen our Jeep. That's like one of our That's most favorite I, things. We did just I'm order. Like, Seat covers with the million dollar plumber. I love simplify. It's just getting logo. Uh, yeah. Are you listening to me? I am. The logo on the seat covers. Yes. We branded our Jeep for heaven's sakes. Get, Why not? Yep. Your face is everywhere. Yep. Mm-hmm. It's gonna be everywhere. It's gonna be on my <laughs> boat. On your plane. Boat. Right. Um, my mugs are over. Oh, Patrick, okay. you, you didn't get those, Patrick. You didn't get Patrick. Them? Huh? Oh, it's California. It probably well, was confiscated. Probably. Well, heads are going to roll, Patrick. That's right. That's all I have to say about that. I'm going to talk to Newsom about that, <laughs> Governor Newsom. <laughs> well, <please. laughs> anyway, so what the the chores Ann said, um, what did you say? Was Not laundry. Clean, what was hers? Cleaning bathrooms. Cleaning bathrooms. Yes. Yeah. Ugh, worst. Load. Cleaning bathrooms. Yes. Mm-hmm. All um, right. Laundry. Laundry. Okay, Ricky, do you That's really right. do the laundry in your house? Hmm? Mm-hmm. Huh? Or does Mrs. Hudson do it? Okay. So, I, d- I did it this week. <laughs> you did, because <laughs> you're smart, honey. Yeah. <laughs> Begins in the kitchen <laughs> and the laundry room. <laughs> if your I'm, wife is an accident. I'm learning. After gal. how many years, I'm finally learning. Yeah. Okay. It took me a while to train All right. you, but you're doing pretty good, I would say. Aaron says, I don't like come, I don't like to come home to do anything plumbing related after doing it all day. Not a chore to be, but still. Yeah. Yeah. I haven't um, done plumbing. Right now, our, our uh, guest bath uh, toilet's broken. <laughs> <laughs> it's a flapper issue, but I don't want to touch it. I don't want to go. I don't want to do anything with I don't want to touch a toilet. Baby, call okay. the plumber. That's, I, that's what right. said. Baby, call the plumber. Call the plumber. Okay. Right. We'll do that. Yep. Um, yeah. And so the same thing. I mean, with plumbing, do you want to come home and do your own plumbing? Of course not. Who wants right. to do that? Right. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, sometimes he does the laundry. Okay. Good for you, Ricky. Good man. That's good. Good man. Mm-hmm. Um, so, what? what's, what's well, we're talking the about? Chore you this, loathe. What, what, what chore do I loathe? Mm-hmm. 
any tour. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys haven't caught this by now, my whole thing is how can I do the least, you know, from even making the most money with doing the least amount of work? Uh -huh. How can I stay on top of the to numbers? Right. It's the whole thing. That's the, the freedom lifestyle. You know, that's how I came up with HVI. I got so tired. I wasn't, I wanted to just sit by the pool. You mean I got to talk to somebody? I got to go look at the numbers? I got to, no. no, there's got to be an easy there's way to say it. Be a better <laughs> right. Way. And I found it. Okay. Uh -huh. All right. Kay. And we're, we're all about that. Mm -hmm. Okay. GB says call a plumber. That's right, brother. <laughs> Keep them in business. That's right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So, what well, are all this, about? Well, What's this, your point, well, baby? this question's kind of taken us to, you know, really what, what chore do you hate doing? Because mm -hmm. we're talking about how to create, you know, how to create more um, to, hours yes, in a day. That's what the show is entitled, right? Okay. Create more hours in the day. There's, there is only so many hours in a day. Everybody's got 24, right? Every, 24 everybody. Mm -hmm. Every human being has the same amount of hours in a day. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, the successful, the non successful. Um, the workers, the, the lazy, the right, blah, the, the wealthy, the, the poor, mm -hmm. whatever you know. Everyone has the same amount of hours. Right. Okay, so how how do you create more hours in a day? Mm -hmm. You know, and so as we're working on our you know on our businesses, you know, so how how do we do that? Mm -hmm. And and a sad thing about uh, is because where we come from, and this goes back to you know we we talk about this can you know, um, you know twenty percent right. Mm -hmm. Well, twenty percent of of our success of mm -hmm. having a successful plumbing business are these systems and equations and right. the right things to do, right? Marketing, all that kind of stuff. Yep. 80% is what we have up here. Head trash. The head trash. Right, which is yeah. what we're talking about. Right. And how, mindset. Right. Mm -hmm. And how we've been conditioned not to have a million dollar plumber mindset. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, we've really been conditioned another way. Scarcity. Right. Mm -hmm. Bingo. Bingo. Okay, and part of that 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 scarcity mindset is mm -hmm. we do everything ourselves. Mm -hmm. In fact, we actually can get this false this pride that you know I, I changed the oil on the I car. Say that. I mean, that's mm -hmm. what guy. I, I mowed the, the right. I mowed the yard. lawn. Mm -hmm. You know, I, mm -hmm. I, I do these kinds of things. Right. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, and so really that is holding us back from the time that we can really be working on our business. Yes. And okay. if not working on your business, doing other things. Doing we'll other about. things that are really, right, that be really on what you really want to do. Right. Okay. All right. So that leads us to point number one. Okay. Point, okay. Number, point one. number one. Your time is more valuable. Mm -hmm. Okay. Your time. Your time is more valuable mm -hmm. to the plumbing business, to your business. Right. Your time is more valuable mm -hmm. than what it costs to pay someone to change the oil. Mm -hmm. Or mow the yard. Or mow the, mow the yard. Or, or to do the laundry. Clean the house. Or clean the house. Mm -hmm. So you could, you, know, you could be cleaning the house, mm -hmm. or you could be working on your business. Mm -hmm. which one? Which one do you think mm -hmm. yes. works out better? Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. Right. You mow the lawn, mm -hmm. okay, or you can create your pricing system. <laughs> For you guys in the uh, academy, the flat rate taskmaster, mm -hmm. which is time. vital. Mm -hmm. Right, which takes time. I mean, that's... And it's, it's more important to your business and to the value of the business. Correct. All right. We just had one of our clients who went through, po evaluation. Went through evaluation to see mm -hmm. where their company is worth. Mm -hmm. uh, by the way, went from zero to a got lot. to a lot. Got a multiple, seven almost figure. a right, mm -hmm. a seven figure right mm -hmm. that valuation. And one of the things that came up in there, <gasps> what that made their business valuable. That was? made their, that, that they said was made their business valuable mm -hmm. was their own pricing. Their own, flat, price book. their own price book, the flat rate, not something they bought off the shelf. Mm -hmm. Okay, their which own. their own, mm -hmm. which that becomes intellectual property. Yes. So as well as branding and what was the other right, branding they, and or, systems and systems, <laughs> huh? 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 <laughs> All right, hey, I just tell you, it's simple. But will you do it? I I don't, I don't know. know. Okay. <laughs> they did. <laughs> they did, mm -hmm. and and, they're, and now their business right. is worth seven figures. Okay. So. Others did it, and they're flying on a private jet to mm -hmm. Napa. Mm -hmm. Others are vacationing in Florida. You know, mm -hmm. all right, okay, mm -hmm. but it's it's. Just, and uh, let me say one thing, that's what business is for. Right. You'll hear other people say that you know business is to serve the com your your plumbing business is to serve the community and blah blah blah. Um, yeah, that you're you're. Kumbaya, <laughs> my friend. Let me finish. So. Kumbaya. Seriously. Yeah. So and and your business yeah. is. You, is, you do serve the the community, right? Plumbers protect right. the health of the nation, absolutely. Right. But business sole purpose is to make a profit for the owners right that's the purpose of a business Boom. period right it, that, there's nothing wrong with that and there's nothing wrong if with you're that, not doing that then it's a hobby right okay so yeah the sole purpose of a business right um, is to turn a profit for the owners now you do how can I apply for coaching Patrick there's a waiting list so <laughs> right 
We'll put your name on it. <laughs> Um, so there's other things that go Crazy along, Basinga. obviously, with with your business and taking care of employees mm. and all that. But that is not the sole. That's not the the goal of a business. A business is to make money for its owners, whether it be shareholders or owners. Right. Right. So, exactly. That right. is that is the. So the, all the other stuff about your business is just to serve the community. That's crap. It's a lie. Right. So there you go. Now, those are nice things, and of course, we want to be about our community of and course. those kinds of things. But the business, the business itself, mm -hmm. is about making money. Right. Okay? Mm -hmm. And, when, and you then, make, when you make money, mm -hmm. that provides all kinds of opportunities, opportunities. for, for right. others. Right. Yes, and then you do with the money, you do with the money what you want, whether right. you want to give it all to charity, whether you want to invest it, whether you want to go out and buy a Lamborghini. It's your right. money. You can decide whatever you want to do with it. Exactly. But that's what a business is about. Exactly. And that's all I have to say about that. Well, I'm, I'm glad. Boy, you're a little bit of a soapbox. Is she, she, you're, she kind of stepped up there. And, I did. All right. Um, all right. Let it go. Go, baby. Burr go. That's whatever. right. So, okay. All right. All right. Okay. So what was the other point? <laughs> but what was the point well, about your time is valuable? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. So it's more valuable than the time it takes you to you know mow the lawn. Mm -hmm. Okay. Clean um, the house. Clean guys, the house. Too. Guys, if, if you haven't hired a housekeeper for your wife yet, because more than I say that, I mean, that sounds... Whatever, but more than likely the wife is one that cleans the house. I mean, just right. more than likely. So, um, and if she's in the business and you don't have someone cleaning the house, shame on you. Do it tomorrow. In fact, that's one of the first things with, with our private, you know, clients. Mm -hmm. That's one of the first things we, we push towards, is freeing up their time so they can work on the business. Right. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. Helping us, they donate my. <laughs> right. Then donate the money after the Lamborghini. After the Lamborghini, it's your money. You can do, you can do whatever, whatever you want. want with it. Hey, by the way, <laughs> people are employed to make Lamborghinis. That's Lamborghinis, right. okay? Mm -hmm. You know, it's a, you hear them hit on. Uh, see, this is on a this is a poor man, the Thanks scarcity. DK. You know that they hit on us, working class people. That's where we come from. That's why I'm talking about the conditioning. Mm -hmm. So we've been conditioned about those things. You don't mm -hmm. need to be having private jets. Ain't those rich flying around all in their <laughs> private jets? Well, those private jets is a whole it's a whole industry. <laughs> right. Who do you think builds those private jets? Mm -hmm. And there's pilots that fly it. And fly those private mm -hmm. jets and maintain and, those private jets. And the jets. fuel and the maintenance. Uh, right. All that kind of, that gives people, you know. Right. That, and it's their money. Right. Right. That, get, that gives people <laughs> people jobs, which leads to point number two here. Point this is two? Up, point two. All right. Well. By doing these things, it gives someone a job. Mm-hmm. Okay, we are we are a service economy. Yes. What are we talking about? We remember you brought it up. We had yes, a we had a friend. Oh yes. I mean, we had a friend. Um, good people. Good very, people. Very good. You would very but, good people. But we talked about um having someone clean, um their house or or that we had a house cleaner or something. Right, right. Or some, I can't remember how the conversation came up, um but we the he told us we've come to a sad state of affairs where you hire someone to clean up your mess. That was that was his whole mentality. Right. And ours. We're like, what are you talking about? We're, we're giving someone a job. We're creating more time so that we can grow our business. Which so creates that, more jobs. Right, so that we can support the, the charities that we want, so that we can take care of our kids, so that we can get our kids to Which, college. Which, by the way, these people were, had their hands out asking for charitable donations. Yes, because they were in. Because they anyway. didn't want to work. No, well, I'm gonna go no with, that's not true. <laughs> I, that is not go, true statement. I know, but, <laughs> but it, I just take it from. No, but, look, they, but they were where, where, looking where do you, for. Um, Support. Mission support. Yes. Right. So, so where, where do you think that support comes from? Right. You it know, comes from us creating more time so that we can grow our business, so that we can have more money to support other charities and right. and employees and all those things. Right. right. And so, they still live. Scarcity. Beyond scarcity. Probably right. one of the worst we've seen. Right. And blame everybody else for the, whatever the problems are. Right. Right. So, you know, and that's that mindset that I want to snap you out of. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I reason... I'm saying I believe that you have this mindset because I'm, I'm with you. Right. This is where we come from. Oh, absolutely. Okay. We we. Oh, we never know, had a we come someone from clean, a, clean our house. Right. No way. Right. We we get mm -hmm. that. Right. You know, we do it ourselves. Mm -hmm. In fact, there is some pride of doing it ourselves and that right. kind of stuff and hearing the things that well, that's just frivolous and mm -hmm. you know that's that's um, greedy or mm -hmm. um, Who do you that's think just you wasteful. Are? Right. Th those kinds Must of be things. Nice. Right. I know, I, for some of you, I know our clients are watching. For some of you. Um, when they finally did get a someone to clean the house, people around them, well, gee, right. must be nice to have someone come right. to clean your house. And you're gonna, well, the answer is, yeah, yes, it is. You're but right. That does that does a couple things. First of all, it gives someone else a job. Mm -hmm. so people make a living that way. Right. Okay. All right. You know, just like we, the, we have plumbers. All mm -hmm. right. And we make a living as plumbing. Mm -hmm. All right. People, we're glad that people pay for us. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, but then it also frees us up again to spend more time on the business. 
all right, to create more opportunity, to create more jobs, right. to create more money, which we create more taxes, mm -hmm. which allows us to be in a more position to support our community, mm -hmm. um, not only just in the work, the service that we provide, but in our giving. Um, 9.9 .9 times out of 10, uh, business owners are the most giving people. I mean, yes. the, most generous. The, the most generous people. Most assuredly. That's where the money comes from. Right. Okay? Mm -hmm. that, that's where the money comes from. So, mm -hmm. you know, it's a, it's a circle economy thing that are happening. Right. So you're giving someone else a, jo you know, a job, mm -hmm. you know, cleaning your house. Well, when they need a plumber, they, call, they have the money to be able to call a plumber exactly. to, get, to get the work done. Right. Or right. they may need to get a new washer and dryer. Right. And so they can afford to go get a washer and dryer, which creates jobs for people building washers and dryers, for the delivery guy with the washer and dryer, for the retail store, right? Right. Everybody, everybody wins. It, I mean, that's why capitalism just works. Right. It just does. So get, give someone a job, mm -hmm. okay? Let, give someone, you know, hire the, the, the mowing company. Yes. Okay. A unless, let me preface, mowing is the only thing I can think of. Um, if you have teenage boys, well, yeah, you're teaching your boys to, <laughs> yeah, to work and that kind of stuff, right? right? Or kinda. shovel snow. If you live somewhere where it snows, um, right. either your teenage boys do it or, you know, yeah. preschool, not preschool, um, get them off junior the, high. Get them off the Game get Boy. Get them off the gaming the game and all high. that. Get their butts get out there. The you should not be doing it. You right. and your wife should not be struggling Right, you shouldn't snow. be cleaning the house if you got mm -hmm. you have teenagers in the house, you yes. know, boys or girls. Mm. It doesn't matter. Yes. You know, that so, kinda. yeah, if you've got teenagers, that's right. that's part of the responsibility. Um, hey, NP, just joined the Success Camry 9. We've tripled our business and hit the mill. <gasps> All what? right. There we go. Oh, that's our Joseph, right? Yep. Yes. Yeah, okay. Nice, right. I just read that. Joseph. Okay. Yes, Joseph. All, All right. right. Tripled our, hit the million dollar revenue mark. <gasps> and you, I didn't know that. Right. I didn't know we hit a million. Right. Did you know that? No, I didn't. Joseph. Okay. All right. right, there we go. And you mm -hmm. did it. Yeah. All right, thank you for the recognizing that, you know, yeah, you followed the system, but mm -hmm. you did it. Mm -hmm. You did it. That's that's the that's big deal. That's exciting. Congratulations right. to you All and right. Melissa. Um, uh, Nikki says, my wife and I had the same cleaning lady for 18 years. Gives us more time to make more money in our business and, and spend time, I'm assuming, says, with family. So, exactly. Yes. That, that's the other part of this. Smart. And I love this picture. Did you my, see that? Yeah. <laughs> of them. And, um, that right. was a cute little picture, his profile picture. Might be, uh, yeah, see my, it right there? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, see, they get to spend more time with his family. Yeah. That's what it's about, guys. Yep. I love that. Thanks, Mickey. Okay. Appreciate that. What did Matt Delney say, Sparky? Yeah, so he's already putting his kids it to work. Works, um, right. Oh, oh, that's Chris. Um, it works. Yes. Yep. My three-year-old works harder than most. Because well, yeah. he, he's a Delney. Right. Mm -hmm. And that's <laughs> that, that's not shocking. No. <laughs> um, because he comes from um, an entrepreneur family. That's right. Okay. Mm -hmm. that, that understands, you know, what, what work means. Right. You know, and what it takes. And what it takes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. So, no, yeah, so hire, okay? Hire, hire that. someone. And All right, can, let yeah, go. Think, yeah, Don't worry about what your things. friends and family. No. They're going to blow you out of the water. No. Okay. No. Just, just do it. Just do it. Yeah. And then okay. share it with, come on, on this page or something right. and, and share, look what I did. And you'll have people that will support okay. you. Okay. So. Mm -hmm. All right. Speaking of sharing, I do have something I want to share with you. Whoa. My million dollar plumber blueprint. <laughs> All right. All the specs you need. Some of the stuff we're even talking about here. We laid, I laid the specs out for you to have a successful, self-sustaining, and profitable um, plumbing business. All right. Simply type free in the comments or go to themilliondollarplumber.com slash free isn't that it <laughs> free, that's yes. right or is that free okay to grab your free copy all mm -hmm. right so do it there we go mm -hmm. see something free for you all know. right okay Aren't you nice? all right hey it's just just what i do i, I just love these guys i know you do if they would just listen <laughs> no, well most do the most do most that do. is the blessing <laughs> you know i spent you know people ask how long i've been you know saying this what so, my year old can run an excavator better than most <laughs> right <time. laughs> mickey I, done, I, I like you mickey i think that's i think that's true mm -hmm. and that there's a reality to that mm -hmm. okay there there is a reality to that mm -hmm. um our kids had a better work ethic than most of our guys working for us well we trained i mean we always told our kids half the you will beat most people if you just show just up. Just show up. That's it, the easiest thing. Right. And our oldest son, he finally admitted when, I mean, of course, we're, we're the worst parents ever, you know, when right. we're late teenagers, but mid 20s, he's like, oh, dad, you were right. Yeah. Like, there, people have no work ethic. He said, I'm beating everybody just because I'm like, showing up. I you don't have to work. I mean, you don't have to work hard. Just right. show up. Right. Then if you get there and actually do a good job, right. They're like, Whoa. you're in. <laughs> you can yeah. write your own ticket. That's what I always tell our mm -hmm. kids. Hey, you show up and just just do what they tell you to do, and mm -hmm. then some. Mm -hmm. You you can write your own ticket. You don't right. need to be asking for raise. They'll be doing whatever it takes to keep you. Keep it. And wouldn't you do that for your people? You, you see course. what I'm saying? You you got a guy that comes on and just works the system, and mm -hmm. it's just going. 
you're going to do whatever it takes to keep Price them totally on. on board. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, Bought whatever everything. it takes, you know. Absolutely. You know, so. Okay, so point three. You got a point three? Point three, yes, I do. I was, and this all leads to my favorite thing. Yes. The freedom lifestyle. You may have heard us mention that a time or two. All right, the freedom two. lifestyle. <laughs> What's the freedom lifestyle? Mm. Whatever it is you want it to be. That's right. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it doesn't have to be about money. Right. It right? isn't about, you know, w with us, the freedom lifestyle meant the, having the time just to be able to go. Mm -hmm. Just to be able to go when we wanted to go. Right. Okay. If, mm -hmm. if you notice, we don't talk a lot about, um, mm -hmm. we, we like some fine things, mm -hmm. but we don't talk about it. And we don't, we're not into a lot of fine things. In fact, mm -hmm. we're downsizing. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I know it's, I don't want to. Pretty soon we're going to get to where we just live in I a mean, cardboard box down by the river. We just want Well, no, not a cardboard. I want, I want the boat <laughs> down by the, o oh, that's on right. the ocean <laughs> and just a sailboat. Mm -hmm. You know? No, I can't do that. I know you can't get that small <laughs> or you just can't be on the water that much. I mean, yeah, you love the water. Yes, but. but. <laughs> but I like that, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. and so it doesn't have to be about, you know, just stuff. No. So, you know, some people are, you know, well, life isn't about stuff. Well, it isn't. Mm, now, sure. some, you know, you'd be surprised. We've had the clients that say, all I need is this. Mm -hmm. I don't need a bigger house than in this. In the beginning. In yeah. the beginning mm -hmm. and whatever. Well, there's nothing wrong that you find, well, that nicer car is nicer. Yeah. Huh. Well, okay. maybe I do want a bigger or house. Or a bigger or, house when you right. have kids with mm -hmm. a bigger yard or mm -hmm. um, is nicer. Or the... You know, the, the house that doesn't have a yard that someone else takes care of. Right. You know, and, and you're paying a higher HO, HOA, mm -hmm. whatever, but someone else is taking care of stuff. Right. You know, th those it's things, mean, nice. yeah, it's nice, okay? Mm -hmm. But the freedom lifestyle is whatever, you know, you, you want it to be. Right. You may okay. want to do missions work, and you want right. to be able to travel once a quarter to go, you know, do missions work in Central America or whatever. It, it's whatever your freedom lifestyle is. It's, that, it's, it's yours. Right. But to have to have the choices, and that's what business provides. Right, a business done right provides those choices. Again, business is meant to um, turn a profit for the owners, and then the owners get to decide what they want to do with it. Not only time, but right. also money. Right. In fact, mm -hmm. that's what we that's what we consider wealth to be mm -hmm. is just not only the, the financial wealth, you know, creating money, which creates a little bit more security. Mm -hmm. Okay, but the time. Right. The time wealth. Mm -hmm. Okay. That that you have more control of your time. Right. Especially when you have little kids. I mean, you don't get right. that time back. You just right. don't. By the time they're you know late or mid teens, teenagers, they don't care. They don't want to be with you most of the time. Right. right. So, but when they're little, you want to yeah, have as much time with them as possible because right. blink of an eye, they're graduating college. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So this all leads to the freedom. Lifestyle, lifestyle, okay, right. and you, that, that you can create right. and for then, yourself. Here's the thing. You've got to decide what that freedom lifestyle is for you, mm. right? We talk about that in the Success Academy, your why. Why, are, why do you have this plumbing business? And it can't be, well, because I want to be successful Full. or I want to make more, more money. money or whatever. Some, that's not tangible. That's not right. measurable. You right? won't make it with those kinds yeah, of things. Hmm. Um, in fact, that's why Module 2 is, is your why. Right. It's a foundational um, issue to the success, to you being successful. Right. In fact, I'd like to make it module one. I wanted to make it module one, mm -hmm. but if that's the first thing you got into and it's like, what are you talking about? What I want to do in the future? Right. It's I like, need oh, to make money. I need to write, you know, I, I, lo I lose you, <laughs> right. okay? But I had to sit on it with module two mm -hmm. because it is foundational to your success. I'd be lying to you. I'd be, I'd be doing you a disservice, disservice if yeah. I didn't let you know that it's foundational to your success. Right. Not that you just created this company that, you know, we're gonna serve the community, mm -hmm. you know, and. <laughs> You know, or, but, yeah, or again, I, I just I want to make money. I want to make right. Yeah, I want to be successful, or I want to have a large company. None of those things are tangible right. and measurable. You've got to know the reason you do it. So what do you want? Right. To, so determining that freedom lifestyle. What does it look like to you? Is it that you want to get an RV and travel across the United States and homeschool your kids and whatever? Right. There's that. Do you want to be able to to go on a vacation every quarter? Do you want to be able to? Um, go and, and send your kids to a private school, whatever that freedom lifestyle is, you've got to determine what that is. Um, and it has to be measurable so you know when you get there. Because society is determining what your lifestyle is. What do you mean? Well, we're being conditioned mm -hmm. to being told that, you know, we work till, you know, we work for Friday, mm. okay. Thank God it's uh, Friday, fr you're right. live for the weekend. Even all the, I gotta be, you know, I get the, even all the sports stuff that our, our kids get kind of pulled into, and I know mm -hmm. that's a touchy, touchy subject. That is. Um, but all that stuff is designed to get you in unfocused, right? Be focused and Be focused. hooked into their into their life, right? Okay, that that they want for you. Yeah, we we um, got out of that. Right, we got out of that 
the sporting thing with, with young right. kids. And Unless it, when our kids wanted, I mean, they truly wanted to it. But the odds right. of even my son who was into football and was big and could be, yeah. the odds of him going to a, a big school to play ball and even mm-hmm. go pro, was, you know, to do all the travel stuff was mm-hmm. just yeah. ridiculous. And, yeah, and you know? separate the family or going in different directions. And, right. Upheaving, upheaval to the family every weekend and having to be in a hotel and all of right. Yeah, we, we just weren't about that. Okay. And to us, that was not a freedom lifestyle. Right. Mm-hmm. So to us, was the freedom lifestyle was, you know, um, that our kids could do what they wanted to. Mm-hmm. We could afford that they, if they were into something, we, we could afford to, to send them to the stuff if they mm-hmm. truly wanted to do it, which we did. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. Always want big bigger. and better. Mm-hmm. That's uh, got to measure it, though, Mickey. Good, right. Got to measure it. Got to be right. able to say, I got there. Because if not, You'll always be dissatisfied, yes. right? You'll never feel like you you arrived. Take it from so, right because yes. the money gets you get you get used to the money. You get used to right. whatever. Okay, mm-hmm. it's like, you know, and it's like I, I want a better car or faster car or mm-hmm. more. It was faster, uh, right? How or much a faster? bigger or a bigger boat or mm-hmm. a bigger How this. Bigger? Or I want more food. I want mm-hmm. finer food. I mm-hmm. want finer. Right. I want better. You know, it's just yes. Right. Vacation time, exactly right. Yeah. Um. So yeah, Nick, um, you got to be able to. Um, to quantify it and you got to be able to measure it so then when you get there um then you can say i made it and right. then your goals may you may change too but you've got to know that you've ar- that you've arrived or you'll always feel like you're striving striving right. striving because you, there's a competitiveness side in you too for mm-hmm. the guys i know even for the ladies um <laughs> yes carl is a different breed because we're all we're all planning on carl to support us we're all, all right, <laughs> right. <laughs> kidding me <laughs> he's driven and him. he's a good example if your kid yes. is truly driven and gifted and get right he's definitely okay gifted. You, you're right mm-hmm. i mean look at look at a swing right. i mean and just I yeah, mean, it's just right. Carl. Yeah, right. truly, Patrick. We're all we're all depending on Carl. Right. At this point, There's a difference. So. so there are. That's what the point. If if the kids are really different, but to be caught up in the social thing of going to all the practices. Oh my gosh! If being, you go to your kids' practices, stop it! Stop it! I, yeah. I mean, stop. Right. Stop. For heaven's sake, right. why go to the games? Right. Oh, don't okay. be a helicopter parent, for goodness sakes. Right. Get a life. Got, I know. Oh, you're gonna, sorry. Right. I know. <laughs> you know, my soapbox about that. Okay. Go. Because we just want the best for you. This, these, we've made these, we've made these <laughs> Listen mistakes. to us old folks. Right. We've right? made these we've mistakes. And, and <laughs> say, um, this is one thing to struggle mm. for sure. Mm. I struggle okay. with sure. So right, even Mickey, the, of knowing where you're at. So, so like, for example, we're here. We've, we've had this yes. discussion recently. What? I mean, we, we're here in Florida, and, and I'm competitive, mm-hmm. and we've downsized, but we don't have the biggest, fanciest, I don't look, I mean, house? the house. No, we have, no, it's a But I see the bigger, townhouse. fancy house, I know. <laughs> and it's like, like, I want that. And I say, no. <laughs> but so that's the thing. It's like, you got to know, okay, when, I, and I've, we've arrived. We like the lifestyle that mm-hmm. we have. I right. mean, I was driving from work, you know, got up this morning, where the sun's shining, the birds are singing, and even, we even got little Florida bunnies, and they hop in front of the Jeep. <laughs> You know, and I have the one. You squished them. I know. I I slow. You just take it easy. You know, it's just I'm going by the water. It's beautiful. I have Mm -hmm. a great. You know, it was International Chess Day. I know the folks. You know, it was okay. International. Yeah, Mondays are international. Yeah, International Chess Day. So I had a great workout. Went up and weight, feeling strong. Sun shining. You know, coming back. (laughs) You know, work on. I mean, and had a meeting or whatever, Mm -hmm. and then answered a couple client things. Mm -hmm. I'm loving the life. Yes. I mean, I I mean. We've arrived. Right. We're, we're, we're where we want to be. Now, we, we don't, now have... We, we, if we had the big stuff, I mean, I yes, don't... But we have other a few other goals right now, but right. Um, but it's not as, as driving as... Because we were, we've were we gotten what we right. need. If, if we stayed where we are right now, we would be happy for the rest of our lives. Cause right. Because we've you know, we got another good 20 years, right? But we, right. Yeah. <laughs> but, we, but we knew this is what we wanted. Right. So we, we knew we kind of put we this here. We went to live in Florida, and we wanted to have a view of the water. Right. So... And that, that kind of a thing. And so, then we got a Jeep to top it off. And we got the Jeep. Which is an MDP black and gold Jeep. Exactly. So there's All right. that. You that know? was a bonus. Right. Mm-hmm. But, yes, keeping our eye on the freedom lifestyle, what our freedom lifestyle right. is. Right. So we knew we were so, so we knew. Mm-hmm. So you know you, that you've arrived and mm-hmm. you, you've hit it. So we've hit that. Right. So, me, so get, write it down, guys. Right. You know, write down what it is. Um, again, if you're not in the academy, we kind of go through those exercises and stuff. But mm. um, in the academy. But if you're not in the academy, start writing down. Think about what do I want? You know, how, and how do I measure it? DW so, has a good point. People mm-hmm. do things because other people do things. Mm-hmm. Right yes. on, brother. It's See, it's trying to follow other. Make create your own path. Okay, right. you're an eagle. Soar soar your own path, and it's okay. I don't mm-hmm. I don't need to go do this because they're doing that. No. You know, at my age, all all the guys are driving you know convertible Beamers and Jags and all that. Mm-hmm. Leave that. For and time. and it's like part of me, you know, or even the Bentley, you mm-hmm. know, and it's like the convertible. Well, I yeah. don't want to be. I don't want to be that guy. Mm. 
And so it got a G. Got I a G. purposely did that. Mm -hmm. I mean, because I don't want to follow. I want to follow everybody else. Right. You know. Um, Ricky said, "My Laura I forgot that his wife was named Laura. Yeah. Um, would like to be able to go on vacation two to three weeks a year, at least twice a year. All right. Okay. So put that down, and then um, what you need to do, Ricky, is. Write down where to go, not just vacation, right? Where do you want to go? What do you want right. to do on vacation? Do you want to go tropical? Do you want to go mountains? Do you want to go Italy or whatever? Right. You know, what, what does it look like? Um, and then start writing that down. I take my wife, Laura, um, on vacation twice a year for two weeks to Italy, to right. Switzerland, to But blah. to get there, I have to have the systems in place and grow as a leader, a father, and a husband. And Ricky, I'll tell you it's simple, brother. Mm -hmm. Just take responsibility. Mm -hmm. Just, just take responsibility, okay? Mm -hmm. Take responsibility as a leader. Step up and, and claim that you're the leader. Take responsibility as a father, okay? First, take respons all that doesn't matter unless you're able to take responsibility as a husband. Yes. Okay, that that's is, number one that's theory. number one, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. But uh, just first take responsibility. I mean, there's, you don't need a lot of fancy, that, that's what I see missing from, from most, most men, mm -hmm. is taking responsibility. Right. You know, because it yeah makes you okay. responsible and it's it's the Adam sin. We have a tendency mm -hmm. to uh, just kind of be doing our own thing over here. Mm -hmm. Like you always say, Adam was busy playing video Ad games. Adam was busy. It was playing Satan video games. Satan over with the and, tempted Eve. And tempted Eve, and mm -hmm. Eve is very capable. We our mm -hmm. women are very capable yep. of handling themselves. Mm -hmm. Okay, but mm -hmm. it wasn't their job to handle Satan. It was Adam's job to just strike Satan down right then and there. Yeah. Okay. But he's busy. But, he, but he's busy playing games mm -hmm. or watching the game. Mm -hmm. Guys. Stop watching the game. Uh, BV, hey, right. BV. I'm um, going to keep growing as a person by continuing to challenge myself to show my kids that 8 to 5 drones. What? 8 to 5 drones? Is that what that says? Can you read the rest of that? Yeah. Um, or for the masses, but not for the... Can't read the rest of that. Right. Hopefully everybody else can. But oh, well, I'm saying 8 to 5. Working 8 oh. to 5. Oh, work, okay. Right. To, train oh, train their time yes. for money. Yes. Okay. That's a good right. point. Good for you, BV. And All right. BV joined the Success Academy, I saw. All right. Welcome, brother. High five. Okay. Do the stuff. Do the yes. stuff. You know, mm -hmm. I think uh, some of us take on um, too much. Mm. Like what? Yeah. That would be a good question. Yeah. Like yeah. What? Taking on what too much? Like um, coaching your kids. Um, being a leader at church. Yeah. Just yeah, um, everything, everything, everything. Right. Uh, yeah. Being a leader at, um, you know, in the community. Right. You know, that, As that you're growing of, your business you know, in, in the beginning that the, needs to be the business's priority is, is well not over family not a, right right but, but over everything else it just is it just has to be there's a, that's the season that you're in as your business grows and you've got other people that are mm -hmm. at least running the day-to-day -day, then you can be more involved in community or um church or whatever joseph's about to start module two mm -hmm. and start my why roadmap all right all right joe take okay. it serious brother yes. okay and looks uh, like he's got a better uh, other okay there. do it with your better other mm -hmm. okay this is foundational to do your success together. all great men all very successful men knew why they were doing what they were doing mm -hmm. and it was bigger than what it was that that they were doing mm -hmm. okay it wasn't it ain't about plumbing right okay mm -hmm. you're not if you love plumbing Stop doing the, don't own a plumbing business. Go be a great plumber for someone. Right. Hey, Lenny. Okay. Systematic All right. Systematic flows. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Have to Katie. catch up later. <laughs> hey, Katie. Katie. Love All right. You, Katie. There we go. <laughs> oh. uh, okay. So anything else do we have to say nope. about that? No. Nope. Need to plumber? be the king for your mm -hmm. kingdom. Danny Amen. Penn. Danny Penn. Oh, amen, brother. Yes. Love, Boy. love this guy. He's a fighter. He is a you know, fighter, it, and he's made big changes. He's yes. one that has stepped up and taken responsibility for him, his family, his business. That's why I'm so proud. Oh, he's right, killing he's it. taking responsibility. Mm -hmm. Is it easy, Danny? No. no. Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. You know, if it's easy, everybody be doing it. Exactly. Okay, but but winners stick with it and mm -hmm. just do it, do it, do it, mm -hmm. day after day after day. Never give up. And it will come your way. Yes. Okay. You will succeed if you don't give up. Right. It, it's just, it's simple math. Right. You will succeed if you don't give up. Okay. Don't look at, um, don't point the finger at, you know, well, it's, you know, this president or this economy or this or that. Yeah, or don't that. participate. Like, don't, right. Don't participate in, in, okay. in that economy. Don't participate in all the other crap. Create your own. Okay. Guys, this mm -hmm. is, this is the um, success equation. Yes. Okay. It's all right. Easy. So yeah. Million Dollar Plumber Mindset. This was part four in our four part sermon. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and next week, we yeah, believe, we, have we haven't confirmed, but we're pretty sure we've got a, a, a bonus, bonus. Epi episode, yes. which will be 
Great. A little surprise for you. Mm-hmm. Okay? So join us. All right? Yes. But the, all these things Monday. we've covered, we go over in the Success Academy. We okay? Do. So if you're, truly, you know, if you're truly wanting to learn these things mm-hmm. and wanting to take your, your business and your life to the next level, I've made it easy for you. Okay? I've just shared with you what, what works. Uh, and I think more importantly, I've shared with you what doesn't work. Okay? Because <laughs> we did them all. Because my <laughs> mistakes. Okay? Well, yeah, your mistakes. Yeah, my mistakes. Clear. Okay? <laughs> all right. So if you're not a member of the Success Academy, Become a member of the Success Academy, okay? Again, we cover all these things, and it's laid out for you in 12 bite-sized modules. I laid out for you a module a month, okay, Mm -hmm. so that you can consume the information so it's not overwhelming, all right? And then you can... Take you know, learn that information and then own that information and put it into play. And then go rewatch it. Okay, mm-hmm. right. And then the next module is introduced. Okay, right. the next step. Mm-hmm. All right. And it so, builds on themselves. Right. So it's so important. Okay, that that you go through it in that way. All right. Mm-hmm. And you can check it out for free. I make it easy for you. Okay. You can check it out for free. Fourteen day free trial. Mm-hmm. So if you're kind of nervous about being caught or whatever, okay, it's a fourteen day free trial. Yeah. All right. Simply type success in the us, comments. Drop us. All right. Or go to the million dollar plumber com forward slash success. But you All right. Hate us. No, you won't. Don't be okay. <laughs> All right. There we go. It's good. Hey, it was fun, fun hanging out with you. All Thank right. You. As always, I'm going to remind you that you were purposefully and wonderfully created and you were created to do great things. Mm-hmm. So plumb like a champion. Thank you for tuning in to Potty Talk Live with Richard Bainey, the million dollar plumber. If you enjoyed this show, share it now. Just do it. To catch past episodes and get alerts for new episodes, turn notifications on now. And join us again for more tips, techniques, and strategies to help you grow your plumbing business.